During the early Jurassic period, two lineages of aquatic reptiles became dominant in the seas, the ichthyosaurs and the plesiosaurs. Although plesiosaurs did not possess the fish-like body shapes of the ichthyosaurs, they were nonetheless very well adapted to a marine life. Plesiosaurs were divided into two groups, plesiosaurids, which had long necks and small heads, and plesiosaurids, which had short necks and large heads. Plesiosaurs are thought to have been fish eaters, that used their long necks like a sling to throw the head at prey in a very fast darting movement. Pleosaurs were more like modern-day killer whales, as they were powerfully built, with enormous heads. Macroplata, meaning big plate, was a genus of plesiosaurs that lived during the early Jurassic period. It was a medium-sized animal, reaching 5 meters in length. Macroplata is currently classified as a plesiosaurid, although it possessed features similar to both plesiosaurs and pleosaurs. Macroplata had both a long neck and a large head. The long crocodile-like head made up half the length of the neck. It also had numerous neck vertebrae, 29 in total. The skull of Macroplata ended in a needle-like snout, and the two lower jaws were fused for most of their length, instead of at the tip. Another interesting feature of Macroplata is the structure of its shoulder girdles, which indicates that its front paddles were capable of producing a powerful forward stroke, making Macroplata a fast swimmer. The fossil remains of Macroplata were discovered in England in 1930. Macroplata seems to have been a long-lived genus of marine reptiles. The two species that scientists recognize are divided by a span of 15 million years, although they might represent different genera.